Taurus, welcome. This is the Empress. All right, so we're going to take a look into February 2019. All right, so this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Taurus. Um, sun, Moon, Rising, um, as well as Venus, Taurus, okay? So these energies can go vice versa. This could be you or this could be your partner's energy. All right, we have a jumper. Oh my gosh, guys. This has literally came out for every reading that I have done, okay? So let's let's see what message, what other message do we have for Taurus? What other message do we have for Taurus? Okay, what other message do we have for Taurus? For Taurus 2019, February 2019. All right. What other message do we have for Taurus? All right, one more. Here we go. Okay. What message do you have for Taurus? This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Taurus. For the month of February, guys. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click the bell to subscribe, guys. All right? So if this message happens to resonate with you guys, make sure you leave me a thumbs up as well as a comment in the comment section below. I love to read my comments. I love to know what's going on with you guys, right? So let's take a look. One more shuffle. No, we're going to do two more shuffles. All right? Two. One more. Three, let's get it popping. Let's see. How much just do we have for my Taurus? The Moon Rising Venus Taurus. All right, guys. Bottom of the deck, guys. We have the Two of Wands. So this is talks about preparing and planning here. Okay. Um, some of you guys could be dealing with the Pisces Cancer Scorpio. Um, two of Pentacles. Some of you guys could be juggling. Um, maybe you're juggling your um, feelings or your emotions or how you feel about a situation. But I feel like some of you guys are preparing or making plans here. So you guys are dealing with the fire sign. I'm getting water energy as well, or Libra Gemini Aquarius. All right, so let's take a look. This is interesting. All right, so past energy, guys, we have deception. Deception, okay? So we have the queen of wands here. Some of you guys are dealing with the fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But this is someone that is wild free, um, who doesn't like to conform to a standard way of doing things. They live their life. They have fun. Okay. Some of you guys could be dealing with someone that is deceptive or you could possibly be the one doing the deception, the deception, doing the deception. Okay. So Libra, Gemini, Aquarius is energy. Some of you guys, someone is very hasty here. Someone is wanting some type of clarity or some type of truth about someone not being honest here. Um, and it could possibly be in regards to a sexual connection that you possibly have with someone. But some of you guys are feeling stuck here. OK, because someone is if someone wants some type of truth. It's either you or it's, this is your other party. OK, present energy. We have true love. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I feel like someone is offering something to you. OK, I feel like someone is offering something to you. I feel like there's some forward movement into something. There could possibly even be travel. And some some of you guys are celebrating. Some guys, some of you guys are wanting to celebrate. So it looks like there could have possibly been some deception in the past. We're going into the near future. It looks like you guys are having some fun. It looks like you guys are celebrating, possibly progressing progressing and moving forward or possibly even moving with this chariot card. Some of you guys could be dealing with the cancer, but I am getting Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy here. Okay. Someone is offering something here. Maybe you are offering something or they're offering something, but you feel like this person is possibly your true love. Okay. So right now you guys could be content. I'm sensing like you guys are happy. Um, you are having a wish fulfillment. There's three of cups. You possibly are partying, celebrating. And we got the um, chariot card, which is progression and forward movement. All right. So going into the near future, guys, we have this could be the one. OK, it was something here is about walking away from a situation. Some of you guys are walking away from a situation. Maybe some of you guys are possibly trying not to walk away from a situation. Um, maybe this person is the mother of your children here with this Empress card. Or some of you guys are wanting to uh, want a new start. Some of you guys are wanting attention here. Some of you guys are possibly feeling um, alone or uh, feeling the need to do some soul searching here with this hermit card. But some of you guys could also be dealing with the Virgo. Um, you, I feel like some of you guys are trying to keep from walking away because you feel like this person could actually be the one. Um, this person could be um, very, very beautiful or... Um, this could be the mother of your children here with this Empress card. But some of you guys are definitely um, looking for looking to win a situation or come out on top. You're trying to find a way to where this is beneficial to you. Um, 
I feel like some of you guys are resisting walking away from a situation. Some of you guys are resisting from walking away or trying to hold on to something or find a reason to stay. What additional messages do you have for Taurus? What additional messages do we have for Taurus? Sun, Moon, and Rising Venus, Taurus. Please give me some additional messages do you have for my subscribers? Please give me additional messages for my subscribers. What messages do you have for Taurus? All right, Taurus. Bottom of the deck, guys. Here we go again. You guys are planning something. You guys are planning something. You're planning on communicating how you feel to someone. Um, Taurus with this King of Pentacles. This is Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Um, I feel like you're planning on speaking or planning on expressing how you feel. Okay. Queen of Wands. Here we go again. Some of you guys are definitely dealing with the fire sign. All right. Or this is you. You're feeling really spunky and free and wanting to be more spontaneous this could possibly involve um here with this hierophant card this could involve, involve something traditional um something that is moral has something to do with morals about a book um there's an opportunity here that possibly you don't want to take because there's possibly something in regards to finances so you are still trying to tame yourself. Like you're not trying to overspend. You're not trying to overspend is what I'm getting. You're not trying to overspend. In the past energy, we have the star card. Some of you guys could be dealing with an Aquarius, but I feel like in the past, something was on hold. You were putting something on hold. Um, something about something temporarily. It's like a temporary hold on something. You're putting a temporary hold on something. I feel like you was going to go back to it. You were putting it on hold for now. But you're you're going to go back to it. I feel like here you could be feeling a little sad because this is something that it's something here that you want to do. You're making plans for something. It's something here that you want to do. But you, you're not sure if you have the resources or you, you it's like you're not trying to go broke behind it. I feel like. Um, there's you're wanting things you're wanting to see things go in your favor you some of you guys could be dealing with the aries or someone here could be really could be really really um controlling here i feel like you do want to see things go and go in your favor but some of you guys are definitely dealing with the aries some of you guys are wanting to take a risk some of you guys are wanting to take a leap of faith um, are going to take a leap of faith going into the near future. You're going to be happy that you did. Um, there's some type of balance here. Some of you guys are dealing with the legal system or the court system here with this justice card. Um, but I feel we got the sun card and the eight of wands. So this is good news. There's good news coming into the near future here. Um, if you guys are dealing with something in regards to courts, there's possibly good news coming. If you guys are dealing with the Libra, there's good news coming. I do sense that there's some type of risk or some type of leap of faith that is going to be taken in, in the near future. And you guys are going to be happy that you did. Okay. All right, Taurus. I'm I'm glad that you guys um took a look at my reading today, guys. If it resonated, make sure you leave me a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Okay. Make sure you guys are leaving comments. I love to read your comments. I love to know what's going on with you guys. Okay. All right. So there's more to come within a um, week. Um, there's new things that are going to be brought to this channel. All right. So don't forget to click the bell. Okay. Because there's going to be lots of notica notifications coming from Empress Speaks. There's lots to come to this um, channel guys. All right. Ciao for now. I will get with you guys later.